Hey, it's Matt the Momo Hunter from McGee Farms, and going to be talking today about one of our main workhorses here at McGee Farms. It's the Kawasaki Mule Model 3010. This is, I believe, a 2005 model. We bought it new. This has been an incredible machine. I mean, this is our workhorse, and uh, we'll talk a little bit about it, show you a few modifications I've made, and then I'm going to do a couple other videos of windshields and some a few other things that we've done. So start out, this was not the first, but one of the first of the uh, UTV side-by-sides that came out. And this thing is like a tank. I mean, this has been through so much. Four-wheel drive, it'll go anywhere. Unlike a lot of these newer ones, it's got a longer, bigger bed. You can fit a lot more wood or whatever, you know, you're hauling around. Uh, four-wheel drive I mean this thing will pretty much go anywhere it's got a bench seat on it you can get three people in there uh, we put some seat covers on just to protect the regular seats a few of the things that I've done to this and I do this to a lot of my side-by-sides I do it to all of them once the battery goes I replace it with uh, just a lawnmower battery the riding lawnmower type they're 25 bucks 27 bucks something like that at Walmart uh, we do a lot of trail riding. We've got a lot of kids that come up. And uh, so I get these U-Trax jump seats and put in them. And these things are great to you know, give you a little more space for someone to go with you. Put some rear view mirrors on, pick these up on Amazon. Same thing here. Got some uh, grab handles. I've got a top I made for this years ago. When I did this top, you couldn't just buy them, or if you could get them, they were incredibly expensive. So I found this actually on the side of the highway. I sat there for a couple of days. Nobody ever claimed it. I think it's to a John Deere Gator or a uh, Polaris Ranger. But I did modify it a little bit, made it fit. Put some LED lights on here. It makes a big difference because the original lights that come on this uh you really can't see anything uh engine to get to the engine you've got just little hooks little latches undo them on both sides lift the bed up let's try that again it was uh in neutral, rolling back on it. Get into the engine. The one thing I love about this, this is an easy machine to work on. You can pretty much get to any, anything on it. We put a lot of miles on this, a lot of hours. The only thing we've really ever had to do is I've replaced the fuel pump on this probably six to eight times. That and some spark plugs and oil. That's it. It really has not needed any other maintenance on it. So anyway, a little bit about our mule. Like I said, we're gonna do a couple other videos on it. It's cold here, it's winter time. Getting ready to put windshield, put the back window on, and I'm gonna build some doors for these. And so you'll be seeing the videos as I do that. Again, it's Matt the Momo Hunter for McGee Farms. If you like this, please uh, subscribe to our channel. Consider leaving us a like or maybe a comment. It's all appreciated.